Hey there, Buster. Looks like a hot day out in the desert. Whoa, look at that ahead. A big mountain with smoke rising from the top. What was that? It's Frida the sports car. She's speeding off toward the smoky mountain. I think she wants to race. Buster and Rita are speeding across the desert together. Rita is faster. Go on, Buster, you can do it. Buster is using that ramp to jump after Rita. Phew, that was a fun race to the top. But look, what's that? Hot molten lava? I think this is a volcano. It could erupt at any moment. Uh-oh, Buster, careful of that rock. Oh no, it's fallen into the lava. Phew, nothing happened. Oh no! I think the volcano is erupting. Quick, guys, get out of there. Oh no, there are fireballs shooting out of the volcano. Look out, they'll be really hot. Oh no, Rita is stuck in the sand. Buster is being brave and going to help his new friend. Great job, Buster. Now quickly, drive away. Faster, faster. Phew, that was a close one. Here's Ashley the fire truck. She doesn't look pleased. She's going to have to put out all the fire. Buster and Rita aren't saying anything. They didn't mean to set the volcano off. That was close, but Buster made a brand new friend along the way. Bye, Buster. Bye, Rita. I wonder what Buster has seen. A soft play park? Oh, wow! Look, there's Scout and Digger making a bridge. Perfect for Scout to go under. What's that over there? I think it's a ball pit? Yes, it is! Go on, Buster. You know you want to. Woo! Good jump, Buster. Oh, look, it's Billy the bulldozer. He's jumping on the trampoline. He looks like he's having lots of fun. Wow, Digger, you're really good on the monkey bars. Keep going. I wonder why Billy is pushing all those soft play shapes. Oh, it's for Digger to land on. Great landing, Digger. Ooh, Scout, be careful. That looks difficult to balance. Oh, wow, Scout, you're a pro. Ready, steady, go! Who's going to win? It's very close. Scout finishes first. Well done, Scout. Maybe next time, Buster. That looked really fun. I think Digger wants to play hide and seek. Good idea. Okay, Buster. You start counting while the others hide. Oh, good idea, Scout and Billy. That's a great hiding place. Digger's going to hide in the ball pit and Billy at the top of the slide. Coming, ready or not. Can you find your friends, Buster? Where could they be? Hmm, not there. Don't worry, Buster, you'll find them. You've just got to keep looking. There's Billy. Great spot, Buster. Only two left. That looks funny. Oh, there's Scout. Well done. One to go. Let's check the ball pit. Oh, Digger. Great hiding spot. What a great game. Buster the bus and Scout the car are playing soccer. Buster shoots. Goal. Well done, Buster. Great work. Whoa, it's a soccer bus. He plays for the big bus soccer team. He wants Buster to come try out for the team. But, oh no, Buster is too shy. Scout encourages him, and Buster says okay. He'll come to the big game tomorrow. Scout is very proud of her friend, but Buster is still nervous. That night, Buster is sleeping peacefully in his garage. Buster dreams he's playing on the big bus soccer team. The game starts, but, oh dear, the buses play rough. Now it's Buster's turn in goal. He tries to save it, but oh dear, the soccer buses don't look very impressed. Poor Buster, he's tried so hard. Phew, it was just a bad dream. 
But now Buster's even more nervous about trying out for the team. Scout does her best to encourage him. Buster can do it. She believes in him. <laughs> now it's time for the big game. Robin blows his whistle and the game begins. Oh no, the red bus has been injured. They can't play anymore. Buster will have to step in. Go on, Buster, you can do it. Buster kicks the ball and the game goes on. Buster is going in goal now. The blue bus takes a shot and... Buster saved it! Well done, Buster! You did so well! Hooray! That was so much fun! It's a sunny day in the school playground. And Buster and Scout are drawing together. Uh-oh! Looks like they both want the blue crayon. Buster snatches it. And now Scout is trying to snatch it back. It's given Buster and Bandit a great idea for a game they can all play together. Using their imaginations. It's cops and robbers. Buster and Bandit are the robbers. And Ash and Scout are the cops trying to catch them. Off they go. The chase is on. Buster and Bandit are splitting up. Oh no! Bandit is cornered! Aha! He's got a plan! Where has he gone? Hang on a second! That box is moving! Quick, Ash! You can catch him! He's jumping off that ramp! Go, Buster! I wonder if Buster and Bandit are going to escape. They're all getting very close. Whoa, watch out! Buster and Bandit have driven straight into jail. Hooray for the cops, Scout, and Ash. Time to give up the crayon, Buster. <laughs> that was fantastic. What a brilliant game. Now Scout can finally finish off her drawing. Buster and Bandit are free to go. What a fantastic playtime, everyone! Buster, Scout, Bandit, and Ash are having a race. Buster and Bandit are neck and neck. But Scout's dashed into the lead. Whoosh! Scout won! Nice work, Scout! She really is super speedy! What's that noise? Thunder? Oh no, it's a storm! They should take cover or they'll get all wet! Whoa, that was close! Ash nearly skidded into his friends on the wet grass! Wait a minute, that gives Buster an idea! Whoosh! <laughs> Skidding through those muddy puddles is great fun! They could play a game! See who can skid the furthest! What a great idea! Bandit is going first! Swish! He skidded all the way over there! But Scout thinks she can do better! Vroom! Whoa! Scout went even further than Bandit! Now it's Ash's turn! He's so little, he's spinning round and round. He's all dizzy, but he's gone the furthest yet. Last up, it's Buster. Whoosh! Uh-oh, he's getting out of control. Whoa! Oops! Buster splashed Mommy with mud. Looks like it's time for all the little vehicles to get back home. They're back at Buster's house in no time. But wait! They can't go inside until they're all cleaned up. Mommy's going to use the hose to wash all the mud off. Splish splash! And there! Now all four of them are clean again. But even so, that skidding race was so much fun! Buster and Ash are on holiday at the beach. 
Mommy Bus and Mommy Fire Truck are preparing a barbecue. And Buster and Ash are building an amazing sand castle. Whoa, those waves are really coming in. Quick, the sand castle could be ruined. Ash to the rescue. He's protecting the castle with a wall of sand. Great idea, Ash. Oh, look, it's Iggy, the ice cream truck. Hooray! Oh, no! Ash's wall couldn't stop the waves. They've ruined their sand castle. Buster is very sad. But Ash has got a plan to save it. Buster is too upset to help. Maybe an ice cream will cheer him up. I wonder what flavors he'll choose. Wow, that's a huge ice cream. Whoa, steady. Ash is still fixing the sand castle. Buster could get Ash an ice cream too, but he's upset with Ash because his wall didn't protect the sand castle. Buster's only getting ice cream for himself. Whoa! Ash has rebuilt the sand castle. Good as new! Buster now feels bad he didn't get Ash an ice cream, so he's giving Ash his. Be careful, don't drop it. Iggy gives them another cone. Now they can share the ice cream. Yum, yum, delicious. Hey there, Digger. What's he doing? Ah, he's building a Skittle Tower. Nice work, Digger. They look great. <laughs> oh, look, it's Buster playing with his ball. Hey, Buster, careful where you're kicking that ball. You might... Oh, no! You've knocked Digger's Skittle Tower over. Uh-oh. I think Buster has had an idea. I'm not sure Digger is going to like this. There he goes again. Buster is having a great time. Nice aiming, Buster. But I hope Digger isn't too upset that you've knocked down his towers. Are you ready for the third one? Look, there's Scout driving towards the Skittle Towers. Oh, no! Look out, Scout! Look what you've done now, Buster. Scout is trapped. You'll have to go and get help quickly. Huh? Don't worry, Scout. Buster has gone to get help. Here he comes. He's brought Digger. Digger looks very annoyed that Buster has knocked down his towers. But at least he's here to help. Look! Scout is free again. Thank goodness. Now you better get back to rebuilding those towers. If you work together, it'll take no time at all. That's it, Buster. Heave! Well done, Digger. That's the first tower. Come on, Buster. Put some engine grease into it. <laughs> <laughs> I think Buster is a little tired. Buster, there's no time to rest. There's still work to be done. Get back to it. There we go. Good as new. Nice work, everyone. Oh no, Buster. Don't think about playing Skittles with your ball again now. It's fall. And Buster the Bus and his friends are outside playing. <laughs> Look at all the leaves falling off the trees. What's this? I think Scout has an idea for a game. Oh, Scout wants to play hide and seek. What a great idea. You count, Buster, whilst everybody else goes and hides. Tony the truck is hiding in the barn. Jesse the Jeep is hiding under that box. Diggly the digger is going to dig a hole behind those bushes. Quick, Scout. You need to find somewhere to hide before Buster is done counting. But where? Three, two, one. Coming, ready or not. Where is everyone? Buster's going to seek. Hmm. 
Is anyone hiding in that barn? Yes! <laughs> you found Tony the Truck Buster. What about these boxes? Is anyone hiding here? I guess not. Wait a minute. Is that box following you, Buster? That must mean... Yes, you found Jesse the Jeep. Good job. What about those bushes? Anyone hiding there? Look, there's Robin. <gasps> Did you see that? I wonder if... That's right! You found Diggly the Digger! Hooray! That just leaves Scout. I wonder where she could be hiding. Wait, did you notice something funny about that pile of leaves? There, Scout! Well done, Buster! <laughs> you found all of your friend's hiding places! Wasn't that fun? Look! It's Bandit! He's coming over to visit Buster today! <laughs> Bandit is so excited! I wonder why! Wow! What a cool dinosaur, Buster! And Bandit has one, too! They're off to play at the park! They're having so much fun playing with their dinosaur toys! But wait! What's that? Could it be... a dinosaur? Buster and Bandit are using their imaginations to pretend they're on a dinosaur adventure. What was that? It's a T-Rex! Run! Go, go, go! How will they get across? Quick, the dinosaur is coming! Aha! Buster has his cowboy lasso! Go, Buster! But Bandit is a bit nervous! Come on, Bandit! You can do it! Bandit is facing his fears! Woo! Good job, Bandit! There's no way the T-Rex can reach them over here! Uh-oh! <gasps> or maybe it can! Look! They can hide behind that tree! Quick, Bandit! Wait a second! An egg? Oh! The T-Rex wasn't chasing them after all! It was looking for its egg! Oh no! It's heading towards that cliff! Quick, Buster! Phew! Huh? <laughs> the egg is safe now! The dinosaur is so grateful to Buster! <laughs> what a fun game! And it wasn't really a dinosaur! It was just Diggly! And he was looking for his ball! <laughs> Everyone loves playing dinosaurs! <laughs> Roar! Roar! What a fantastic day playing at the park! It's sports day at Buster School! How exciting! First is the 100 meter sprint! On your marks, get set, go! Go Buster! He's the winner! Hooray! That was easy! Buster is the fastest in school! Next up, it's the high jump! Scout's up first! Scoot, scoot! Wow! That was awesome! Buster thinks he can beat that jump! Off he goes! Oops! Don't worry, Buster! He doesn't look very happy! It's the egg and spoon race next! Get ready, and go! Buster really wants to win! Whoops! Buster was going too fast and smashed the egg! Oh dear! 
And Ash is the winner. Well done, Ash. Buster is annoyed about losing. He really wanted to win. He's so upset that he isn't playing ball with the others. That does look fun, Buster. It's not just about winning, Buster. It's about having fun! Hooray! Now they're all having fun together! It's time to present the medals! Buster is third, Ash is second, and Scout is first! Well done, everyone! What a brilliant day! Today, Buster and his family are having a picnic! Buster is so excited! Mommy Bus is off to get Grandpa. And while she's gone, Buster and Bandit need to prepare the picnic. First, they have to lay down the picnic blanket. Whoa, the wind has blown it away. It looks like a cape. It's Super Buster! Bandit wants a cape too. And it's a tug of war. Buster is imagining that he is a superhero. Super Buster flying through the sky. <gasps> it's bad guy Bandit. Mwahaha! <laughs> He's stolen the picnic. Oh no! Super Buster has got to save it. They are chasing through the sky. Go, Super Buster, go! You can catch him. Oh no! Bad Guy Bandit is aiming at Super Buster with his laser shapes! But Super Buster is too fast! Wow, look at him go! <gasps> Hooray! Super Buster has saved the picnic! But what is that? It's a giant blue laser ball! Oh no! What is Super Buster going to do? Aha! He's using the flagpole as a bat. Bring it on, bad guy bandit. Great shot, Super Buster. Whack. <laughs> wow, that was such a fun game. But oh no, they've made a huge mess. And Mommy Bus and Grandpa are on their way. What are they going to do? Quick. They've got to clear it up. As superheroes, of course. Super Buster and Bad Guy Bandit are clearing up the city. Even superheroes need to clean up after themselves. Just in time. Great teamwork, guys! <laughs> yum, yum! Delicious! And all that superhero work has left them very hungry! Here comes Buster the Bus and Terry Tractor! It looks like they're about to have a race! Buster looks very confident, doesn't he? Terry doesn't seem too impressed. I wonder who's going to win. Here we go. Ready, set, go! And they're away. Buster races into the lead. Come on, Terry, you can do it. I don't think Terry is as fast as Buster. Wait, what's he doing? Oh, cheeky Buster. He's showing off. Poor Terry. Buster sure is confident that he's going to win. You're not at the finish line yet, Buster. Keep going, Terry. You still have a chance. Oh, Buster, don't tease Terry. You're not being very nice. Go on, Terry. You'll show Buster that you don't just need speed to win a race. Buster is really far ahead now. Look at him zooming through all the muddy puddles. 
Oh, Buster, I know it's hot, but you can't be tired. You haven't finished the race. Look over there, it's an apple tree. I think Buster is going to take a nap in the shade. Cheeky Buster, you're getting a bit too confident, aren't you? Oh dear, Buster has fallen asleep. And look who it is, Terry Tractor. He's managed to overtake Buster. Oh, silly Buster, you've slept for too long. Off he races towards the finish line. I'm not sure he's going to like what he finds. Nearly there, Buster. But where's Terry? <laughs> there he is. Terry crossed the line first. Silly Buster, you shouldn't have slept for so long. And you shouldn't have been such a show-off. Because it goes to show, slow and steady wins the race. Bye, Buster. Bye, Terry. <laughs> Hey there, Buster. Oh, what's that? A soccer ball. Huh? Oh, look, Buster. All of your friends are lined up to play a soccer game. And they need one more player. Go on, Buster. This is going to be so much fun. Kick off. Aw, oh, too slow, Buster. CJ, the cement mixer, is going for a shot. Can Jesse Jeep save it? Come on, Jesse. You can do it. Oh, nearly, but goal! Nice shooting, CJ. Great header, Buster. What a kick, Scout. Great block, Digger. <laughs> Scout has played the ball of Digger. Scout's making a run for the goal. Go, Scout. You can do it. No one can tackle her. Goal! Way to go, Scout. Jesse to Scout. Scout kicks it on. Great kick, Digger. Straight to Bandit. Oh, that was a bit rough, Bandit. Is Bandit going to score? Can Jesse save it this time? Oh, no. Jesse burst the ball. Is that the end of the game? Oh, thank goodness. Otis has a spare ball. The game's back on. It's really heating up now. Buster's going for a run at the goal. Oh no, Bandit Bus shoved Buster. That's a foul. Good referee, Robin. <laughs> Bandit's been given a red card. Robin's sending Bandit off. That's what happens when you play too rough. Now Buster gets to take a penalty shot. Come on, Buster. Goal! You did it, Buster. You won the game. And you won a nice trophy, too. That was so much fun. It's a brand new snowy day. And Buster can't wait to go outside and play. It's so much fun to play in the snow. And the best game of all is a snowball fight. Diggly and Scout are on one team, but Buster needs a teammate. Look, there's Bandit. He can be on Buster's team. Though Buster and Bandit don't always get along. Time to start throwing snowballs. Buster and Bandit are hiding behind that hill. Hmm. Buster thinks they should go this way. But Bandit thinks they should go that way. Oh dear, they can't agree. They're not working together as a team. Buster is sneaking through the trees. But Scout has spotted him. Look out! Oh dear. Bandit is trying to sneak behind the fence. Buster and Bandit aren't doing very well. But look! Scout and Diggly are working together. That's it! If Buster and Bandit want to win, they'll need to work together like a team! Whoosh! Off they go! And that's more like it! Now it's a real fun snowball fight! It's much better with teamwork! Who threw that snowball? 
Grandpa! The more players, the more fun it is! His friends are back at school. They are telling each other what they got up to over the summer. Buster is so excited to tell everyone about his shark tooth. But first, Scout is telling everyone what she got up to over the summer. This summer, I went surfing for the first time ever! It was so cool! There was this one wave I saw that was absolutely massive! But I still got to surf it without falling off! And I went so fast! Scoot, scoot! Wow! Scout told such a cool story! Huh. What's wrong with Buster? <laughs> oh, he thinks his shark tooth story won't be interesting enough after Scout's story. Hmm. Ah. Buster is going to tell everyone how he got the tooth. This summer, I went exploring in the deep, dark <laughs> wood. It's full of animals and monsters, <laughs> but I wasn't afraid one bit. <laughs> ah. Oh. Huh? But then, <laughs> hmm. I came face to face with a dinosaur! Hmm? <gasps> but he had a oh. sore tooth. Uh, hmm. So I took it out for him to make him feel all better. Ah. Wait a second. That's not huh? right. Dinosaurs are extinct. Oh dear. Bandit thinks Buster isn't telling the truth. He couldn't really meet a dinosaur, could he? Oh. <gasps> all right. It's not really a dinosaur tooth. Mm. It's a shark tooth. I thought that wouldn't be mm. interesting enough. But Buster, sharks are way cooler than dinosaurs. Go Buster, tell us the story. <laughs> this summer, I was at the beach, but then I saw... Mm. No. Yes, oh. pirates are even cooler <laughs> than sharks. Ooh. Yar, my hearty. <laughs> hmm. Okay, ah. the pirate and me, we found a shark, but he had a sore tooth. So we decided oh. to take the tooth hmm. out with a little help from <laughs> a friendly little bee. <laughs> we took out the sore tooth and then they played catch with it. Gotcha! <laughs> <laughs> and they played on the beach all day long. What a great story! It's so much fun to use your imagination, especially with friends. It's Halloween, and Buster is at Daddy's house. Oh, but Halloween can be scary. Daddy Bus has an idea. He's going to tell a Halloween story. Daddy's going to tell a story of the brave wizard's adventure to find the magic gems and save Halloween. Buster the brave wizard went on an adventure. He had to find all the magic gems. There must be gems in that castle. They're guarded by a monster. <laughs> This wizard must be very brave, Dad. <sighs> the wizard was the bravest of all, Buster! <laughs> ah. <laughs> the hero presses on through the dark woods towards the castle. <gasps> Something stirs in the darkness up ahead in the forest. What is it, Dad? A werewolf? <gasps> A ghost? A were-ghost! <laughs> The mysterious shadow grows larger. Is it the monster? <laughs> he found a jewel. Well done. <laughs> Finally, the wizard reached the mysterious castle. There must be more gems inside, huh? but how to get there? He needs to lower the drawbridge, but how? The wizard could use his magic. <laughs> Good idea. The brave adventurer pushed forward inside the castle walls. Hmm? 
onward into the castle. How brave the wizard is. What will our hero do? Run or continue? Continue, continue. The wizard has to find the treasure and save Halloween. <laughs> but what's that behind them? It's the monster. If the wizard wants to get those magic jewels, he'll need to get past it. Wait, Daddy. The monster must be really lonely. Oh, I suppose so, yes. The monster is lonely. Maybe the wizard should help the monster. He needs a friend. And so the brave wizard rolled up and used his magic to make the castle all warm and bright. <laughs> the monster is you, Dad. <laughs> the monster was so grateful he gave the wizard all the magic jewels. So brave Buster <laughs> saved Halloween for everyone. Hello, Buster. Whoa, look at all that spooky slime. You're splashing it everywhere. Look, it's Terry the tractor. I don't think he wants to get covered in slime. Look how careful he's being. Zoom! <laughs> Wait, look out, Buster. You're heading straight for Terry. Phew, that was a close one. Watch out, Buster. <laughs> Oh dear, you splashed Terry with slime. I don't think he's very impressed. Hawk Buster goes again, having fun in the green slime. Watch out! Oh no, Buster is stuck in the sticky slime. Dear, oh dear, he really is stuck tight. The sun's going down and it's getting dark. Spooky, I hope Buster's going to be okay. Look everyone, it's Terry Tractor. He's come to save the day. Terry doesn't look too happy about it, though. Please help Buster, Terry. He just needs one big push. Ah. Can he do it? One, two, here we go! Ah. Hooray! Thanks, Terry. <laughs> oh, Buster. Thank goodness Terry Tractor was there to save Buster from the sticky green slime. <laughs> Bye, Terry. Bye, Buster. Hey everyone, what a lovely sunset. I bet Buster has had so much fun in the sun. I wonder what that green slime is. Oh no, it's dropped on Buster and I don't think he's noticed. What's happening? Something isn't right. Look at all the gravestones and pumpkins appearing. This is spooky. And what's happened to Buster? I think that green slime has changed Buster into a zombie. That's one big pumpkin digger is carving, and it looks great. Who's that? Oh no, it's Zombie Buster. Digger is really frightened, but I don't think Buster knows what he looks like. Oh look, it's Scout. Buster is so happy to see her. Oh no, she seems scared too. Oh no, Scout is hiding from Buster, just like Digger did. <gasps> Poor Buster is so upset and lonely. Come on, Scout. Buster is your friend. I think Scout has an idea. <gasps> she wants Buster to follow her. Do you see now, Buster? You look like a zombie. That's why everyone is scared of you. Don't worry, Buster. Look, the slime has come off on Scout's wheel. I think Scout has a plan. A car wash? Good idea, Scout. Buster always loves a car wash. Yay, the green has gone. Buster is no longer a zombie. That was super spooky, Buster. Oh my, Scout, you sound like a werewolf. <laughs> Happy Halloween, everyone. <laughs> it's a sunny day at Buster's house. And Buster and Grandpa are having a great time playing together. Mommy Bus is off to work. Will Buster and Grandpa be able to make dinner together? Whoa, some real cooking. Buster is very excited. Let's cook. Grandpa sets up the stove. Hmm, but what comes next? Buster has an idea. It's
it's chocolate sauce. Hmm. hmm. Grandpa doesn't think that's quite right for dinner. Let's take a look at the recipe. They've gathered all the ingredients together. Buster starts by adding some flour to the bowl. Whoa, easy there, Buster. Oops, the flour has gone everywhere. Now Grandpa and Buster are covered in flour. Buster is adding the finishing touches to the mixture. Careful the mixture doesn't go everywhere. Great job, Buster. Oops, Grandpa's tomato sauce has splattered all over the floor. And what's going on at the stove? The pot is bubbling over. Oh, look, it steamed up his glasses and now he can't see where he's going. Watch out, Grandpa. Oh, dear, this isn't going very well. Grandpa and Buster are clearing up the mess. But Mommy Bus is coming home from work. Uh-oh, they still haven't made dinner. What are they going to do? Grandpa gets some fish fingers out of the freezer. Aha, this gives Buster an idea. Time for chocolate sauce. Mommy Bus is wondering what Buster and Grandpa have made for dinner, just as they're finishing up. I wonder what they've cooked. It's fish fingers and green beans. And chocolate sauce. Are you sure about this, Buster? He gives it a try. Hmm, delicious. Mommy also gives it a try. And it's surprisingly tasty. Well done, Buster. Look, it's Cozy Coop at the sweet shop. And they've bought some tasty sweets. Now here comes Scout. She wants to get some sweets, too. They look tasty. But, uh-oh, it's that mean old bully, Bandit Bus. He's stolen Scout's sweets and eaten them. How mean of him. Poor Scout. <laughs> Meanwhile, Cozy visits Buster in the park, where Buster is playing with his soccer ball. Cozy wants to share the sweets with Buster. But, oh no, it's Bandit again. He's stolen the sweets and eaten them himself. And now he's seen the soccer ball. Bandit has stolen it. Aw, poor Cozy is so upset. They got those sweets especially for their friend. But what's Buster doing? He thinks they should follow Bandit and ask for the ball back. It's not right to take things that don't belong to you. Buster and Cozy drive along the road. But what's this? A trail of sweets leading into a cave. That must be where Bandit went. Buster and Cozy are headed inside. They are going to ask for the ball back. <laughs> Look, there's Bandit. But he looks so sad and lonely. Look at all the drawings he's made. Oh, oh dear. Bandit doesn't have any friends. That's why he stole the sweets and the ball. He has nobody to play with. Bandit has noticed Buster and Cozy. Buster asks for the ball back, and Bandit gives it back. He's sorry he made Cozy upset. But what's that noise? It's Scout, and she's brought Otis the police car. She tells him that Bandit has been stealing things, and Bandit ends up in jail. But what's this? Buster and Cozy have come to play with him. Stealing is wrong, but they know Bandit is really sorry, and he only wanted some friends. Happy holidays, Buster. Oh no, Buster doesn't look very happy, does he? Let's go and see what's wrong with him. Buster seems very bored. Has he run out of things to do? <gasps> Did you hear that, everyone? Yes, it's Buster's friend, the Robin. But where could he be? I can't see him anywhere, can you? That's a very big sigh from Buster. <gasps> oh look, there he is. And he's carrying Buster's bobble. I think he wants you to follow him, Buster. Go on, let's see what he wants to show you. Oh, he is bringing back a scarf. Great idea, Buster. <laughs> you should both build a snowman. <laughs> Look at him, using his wheels to pile up all the snow. Clever, Buster. Wow, it's already taking shape. And there's the head. Well done, Robin. A snowman isn't complete without his scarf. <gasps> what are those pieces of coal for? Of course. Now the Robin's gone to find something else. Oh, yeah.
Yes, a carrot for their snowman's nose. What a fantastic snowman. But look, Buster Ooh. thinks something's missing. Wow, mm. that's a big gust of wind. And look, it's blown a top hat to Buster and the Robin. That's what was missing. Well done, Buster. The Robin certainly agrees. <laughs> oh, wow. The snowman has come alive. Buster is so excited. Buster now has not only the Robin to play with, but his new snowman friend, too. Happy holidays, everyone. It's a brand new day, and it's time for Buster to head off to school. There's Diggly. They can go to school together. They're going to race to school. Whoosh! I wonder who will be fastest. Whoa! There's a little duckling in the road. He should be more careful. There's a mommy duck. She's trying to cross the road with her ducklings. But look out! Here comes Terry. Here comes the teacher, too. Oh, no! Phew! Thanks to Diggly and Buster, the duck family can cross the road safely. Aw, they're going to swim in that pond. Uh-oh, that duckling is walking back to the road. <laughs> Good job, Buster. Now the ducks are going back over the road. Buster and Diggly are helping them cross safely. Mommy Duck is crossing, too. Well done, everyone, for helping! <laughs> but Terry and the teacher want to get moving or they'll be late. Wait a minute. I think Buster has an idea. Hmm, what are they doing with those paints? White lines? And some signs? It's a duck crossing! Now the duck family could cross the road safely whenever they like. There's the teacher again. He's telling them to hurry up. The kids had better get to school or they'll be late. Nice work, everyone. Buster and his friends are having a great time camping in the woods with Daddy Bus. Daddy is making some spooky shadows as he tells them a ghost story. Whoa, that monster is super scary. Phew, don't worry, gang. It's only Daddy Bus. Looks like it's time for bed. Good night, everyone. Daddy Bus is off to collect some more firewood for the fire. Good night, Buster. Hang on. What is Buster up to? He's turning the firewood into scary antlers. Scout is fast asleep. Yikes! What is that? <gasps> it's Buster's scary shadow. Poor Scout. <laughs> Don't worry, Scout. It was only Buster. <laughs> now it's Bandit's turn to be pranked. Aha! The spooky shadow scared him as well. Looks like Buster is getting sleepy. But Bandit and Scout have a plan. Buster is sleeping peacefully. But there's a scary monster! And another one! Go, Buster, go! That served Buster right. Great job, gang. What is that? Oh, no! It's a real spooky monster! Phew! It was just Daddy Bus carrying back more firewood. That's enough scaring for one evening. All that joking around has made them very tired. Hey there, Buster. And Digger, too. That's a big sand castle you've built there. It's Sandy Seagull. Watch out, Sandy. Don't stand on the sand castle or you'll... Oh, dear. Poor Digger and Buster. Off you go, Sandy. Cheeky bird. 
What have you seen, Buster? It's a red shape sticking out of the ground. I wonder what it is. Nice work, Digger. It's a triangle. Isn't that cool? And look, Sandy has found a yellow shape, too. It's a circle. Can you find any more, Sandy? Here's another one. This one's blue. Dig it out, quick! That's a square. It has four sides. Whoa! There are so many shapes! Triangles. Circles. Rectangles. Hexagons. Sandy, wait, don't… Oh dear, oh dear. Wait a minute. I think Buster has an idea. Buster and Digger are collecting the shapes up. I wonder what they're going to do with them. They're stacking them up. I think they're building a tower. Just one more piece to go on the top. That's it, Buster. Gently, gently. There. Perfect. Wow. Buster and Digger have made a tower out of the shapes. What a great idea. Now they can get back to building their sandcastle. And look, Sandy has somewhere to stand that won't collapse. Nice work, Buster. <laughs> Bye, Buster. Bye, Digger. Buster is packing his bag for Ash's birthday picnic. He will need a picnic blanket, something to drink. What else does Buster need? Marshmallows to toast on the fire. Thanks, Daddy Bus. Don't forget Ash's present. Buster is so excited to celebrate Ash's birthday. What's wrong, Buster? He looks a bit unwell. He really doesn't want to miss the party. Buster and Daddy have arrived. Time to play some party games together. Hmm, Buster really doesn't look well. But he doesn't want to miss out on the fun. They're playing hide and seek. Oh no, Buster is feeling really poorly. Maybe sitting by the fire will make him feel better? His friends are worried about him and want to make sure he's okay. Maybe some marshmallows will make him feel better. He can't even eat toasted marshmallows. Daddy Bus is taking Buster home to rest. But he can't forget Ash's birthday present. What is it? It's a painting set. That's very thoughtful, Buster. It's given Ash an idea. He's passing a paintbrush to Bandit and Scout. I wonder what they're going to paint. Buster is resting at home. He isn't his usual happy self. He needs to take his medicine and get some sleep to feel better. Well done, Buster. The next day, Buster is feeling a bit better now. But he's still sad he missed Ash's birthday. Daddy Bus has got Buster some warm soup. And what's that? His friends made a painting for him. And they're outside! Hooray! Buster is so happy to see his friends. And the painting has made him feel much better. 